if you're 80 years old, 75 years old, whatever years old you are, and you want to go to another country, you want to go see something, you want to experience something, do it when you can. Because you never know that there's going to be a second chance. There's going to be another moment. If you want to love somebody and tell them you love them, do it now. If you want to spend time with someone, don't postpone it to another day or time. And none of it also made me realize that all these physical things in the world, money, possessions, home, gold, this, that, cars, boats, people, people, men, women, not for me to have any attachments to any of it. Because all of it is going to disappear at any moment. So it made me become free. So I'm very grateful. I'm not bitter to... I'm grateful that in these events and accidents and things happen, I didn't lose an arm, I didn't lose an eye, and nothing happened. And I'm still in one piece. I'm very grateful for it, for everything I learned. As difficult and as hard as it was, I'm very grateful for it. And I don't find myself a victim. I find myself a victor. Okay. Beautiful. Yes, yeah. beautiful. Yeah. Thank you very much. Yeah, thank you for bringing yeah. it up. I appreciate it. And there may be things that I forgot to say, and it may come up for me later. I don't know. But... That was a great topic. Uh, uh, there's been a couple other topics that's been brought up to me that I'm very grateful for you all writing to me and suggestion to suggesting topics. I do want to talk about these other things at the next few academies. Uh, I also have an announcement to make is that I have decided to offer another um, free online global self-awakening retreat. And it's going to be a nine days, nine day retreat. So we're going to, I'm going to be offering that in October. I'm setting up the dates right now. I believe we're going to start on October 10th, but I want to make sure that we get all our ducks in a row. If we don't start on October 10th, we're going to start on October 17th. For nine days straight, every day for two hours. We're going to be doing this. So that's my new project. I'm very, very, very excited about it because I want to offer as something deeper and strong and consistent to the community, to our online community. And give those who can't come to my life training program, they can't afford the life training program, I want to be able to offer this to, to those, of, those of you who are interested in the teachings and can't afford it. So, because we do have paid events and, and non-paid events. But I want to include everybody. So this teaching can be spread. And uh, once we put our ducks in a row, I'm going to ask you all, anybody who wants to help spreading the word regarding the upcoming retreat, uh, if you want to share our posters online on Facebook or Instagram, or if you want to invite some of your friends to join in, and benefit from these teachings. So, so I'm going to put it out and ask you all to help me out. This was a beautiful, powerful meditation that we had. It definitely took me 
far, far deep within. And I had a hard time speaking afterwards. But I knew our friend took a day off to join us on the academy, and I didn't want to disappoint her. Otherwise, I probably would have been still silent sitting here with you. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a short audio video of this meditation and send it to all of you as a gift. Our next academy is going to be on, uh, on next Wednesday. Uh, we're going to continue. I'm committed to do the academies every Wednesday. So we're good on that. And as I have mentioned before, I offer a private mentorship. It's a VIP program tailor-made for your needs. It's called Life Training Program. It's a three-month program that I would be working with you on a one one-on-one basis. And if you have any interest and you want to achieve your spiritual goals, and you can dedicate yourself to it and commit to it, then contact me and we set up a, a free consultation appointment. And we talk about your goals and how this works and the terms and price and everything and see if it's something that it's working for you or if you fit into this program. Thank you very much for joining me. Sending you my love. Wherever in the world you are, stay in your heart. Stay in this place. Get out of the mind by meditation. Dive into your heart and remember your beauty. Remember the love you have. Remember your power. And when I say power, I'm not talking about a personal power for manipulation or accusation of objects. I am speaking about the power of love that exists within you, your power, your presence, that when you are not thinking and you're quiet, our Supreme Soul, Her Majesty, the Supreme Being, Lord God, begins to shine from inside you. These are not just words, my brothers and sisters. Please pay attention. Pay attention to who you are. Because the power of love, the power of God, only comes from within yourself. And because your hearts are pure, and your heart is open. When we connect together, we all enter into the unified field of oneness, the unified field of love. And the transmission of love becomes possible because all of our hearts, all of our minds connect into the one, oneness. And this love transmits so remind yourself every day that you are the source of this love you don't project it on other people don't project it on other things Don't put it on a teacher or a person. Catch yourself when you're doing that. This other person on the other side, as a teacher, is only the reflection. It's the mirror. It's mirroring back to you. 
That's the true teaching. That you are who you're looking for. It's coming from you. So turn your attention inwards and recognize who you are. Beyond your mind. Your mind is going to play all these games. Tells you you're not good enough. You're not worthy. You have earthy desires, fears. Somebody else is better than you. Don't listen to these things, what your mind tells you. Stay with this and feel this. If you feel this, know that it's coming from you, not someone else. And let this grow. Let this love, this power, keep growing within you. Its fire will consume your mind. Soon, your mind will go into silence. Soon, you will really recognize who you are. You wake up from this dream. This dream, this world, is nothing in comparison to the truth of who you are. Don't hang on to it so much. It's nice. It's got a lot of nice things in it. Just enjoy its nice things, but don't hang on to it. Don't get caught up into trying to fix it, trying to protect it. Don't put your attention on it. Just bring your attention inwards. Be quiet. Be still. Don't give in to your, these worldly emotional ups and downs of what's happening in the world. Just keep your attention on yourself, on stillness. And build up this, keep building up this power. Keep building up this energy, this love around you. Without any intentions of using it for anything, be careful, that's the ego will come and will tell you, you're powerful, you're mighty, you can do this, you can do that. Don't even listen to that. You build this up. And you don't need to do anything. You stay in love. And everything you need will come to you. Everything you need will come to you. Build up the love in your heart. Work on that. Everything else will come together. Thank you. Namaste.